Iran has unveiled its first indigenous hypersonic ballistic missile. The announcement is likely to heighten Western concerns about Tehran's strategic capabilities. Iranian state media published pictures of the missile named Fatah. President Ibrahim Raisi was present at the ceremony, along with commanders of Iran's elite Revolutionary Guards Corps. Iran says the precision-guided Fatah hypersonic missile has a range of 1,400 kilometers, and it's capable of penetrating all defense shields. Iran claims Fatah's top speed is matched to 14, that is around 15,000 kilometers per hour. The knowledge of missile making, science and defense, as well as missile and military industries, have been indigenous in our country. It is not an imported technology, so threats cannot remove this advanced knowledge and industry. Hypersonic missiles are the ones that fly at least five times faster than the speed of sound on a complex trajectory. Both of these capabilities make these missiles difficult to intercept. Despite European and U.S. opposition, the Islamic Republic has said that it will further develop its defense missile program. Western military analysts, meanwhile, feel Iran exaggerates its missile capabilities. Concerns about Iran's ballistic missiles prompted U.S. President Donald Trump to ditch Tehran's 2015 nuclear pact with six major powers. Former President Trump reimposed U.S. sanctions on Iran after exiting the nuclear deal, leading Tehran to resume openly previously banned nuclear work. In direct talks between Tehran and U.S. President Joe Biden's administration to salvage the nuclear deal have stalled since last September. <laughs> Come on, come on.